So in the past month, I've become a proud owner of a Hackintosh. Now many of the people watching will already know what a Hackintosh is, but for those who don't know what a Hackintosh is, it's basically a PC that is built in a certain way that can run a Mac operating system. I got this Hackintosh because I'm a video editor, I do graphics, I do 3D work, and I needed something that could handle the workflow and the workload that I was having. But also, I wanted to get into PC gaming, and I thought, what better than have a dual boot machine that is a PC, basically, and I could uh, play online games, I could stream live, I've been playing Overwatch recently, which is a brilliant game, and that was working a dream. Right, so let's go through the components that are in my Hackintosh right now. So for power, I have the Aerocool Integrator 700 Watt. The motherboard I am using is the Sabertooth Z87. Now the reason why I've bought this, as you might see from behind, I have Thunderbolt displays and I needed to get a motherboard that was compatible with this, the Thunderbolt EX2 Dual. So basically, the reason why I got this is so this can work with this and work with them. So for the CPU, I have the Intel Core i7 processor. The version of this is the i7-4790K. Now for graphics, I have the GeForce GTX 960. This is the super clocked version, 4GB GDDR5. So for wireless, the good old TP-Link N900. For RAM, I've got the Vengeance Crossair. Both of these packs have 2.8GB sticks, so that means that my hack is running on 32 gigs of RAM. And I've also got a solid state drive from SanDisk. This is the 256 gig one. This is where I'm running my Mac OS from. And all of that is put into a Crosshair 780T. And like I said, I have this machine running on two Thunderbolt displays and it's running absolutely brilliantly. Now there is a few teething problems and I did have a bit of a nightmare actually getting these two Thunderbolt displays to work. It took me a good couple of days, but once I got them working, I was so happy because one of the reasons why I was a bit hesitant at first to get a Hackintosh was basically I didn't want my displays to not work. I had these displays running on a MacBook Pro prior to having my Hackintosh. So that was one of the factors of like, is it gonna work? And thank God it did. For anyone interested, here is the Geekbench scores and here is my Cinebench scores for this hack. Now like all Hackintoshes, it has been a bit of a nightmare and I do have some issues still regarding with these Thunderbolt displays because sometimes the eyesight camera is recognized and I can use it sometimes it's like there's no camera installed sometimes the USB ports and all that on the back of the Thunderbolt displays work sometimes they don't so in conclusion I am absolutely over the moon with this machine it works great it, it, it's brilliant I mean there is the odd issues that I do need to get resolved but as soon as they're resolved I couldn't ask for more really it's an absolute amazing machine so if you do have any questions regarding this Hackintosh then please do ask away I may not be the best help because I am a noob when it comes to Hackintoshes but I will give any help that I can so please like comment subscribe and we shall see you next time